Hi, I'm Jacques Pépin, and I'm cooking at home. As a Frenchman, it's very difficult for me to have dinner without bread. Sometimes I get stuck. So if I get stuck, what I do very often is a soda bread. It will take you longer. I put my oven on on 425. Now it will take longer for the, the oven to get hot before I finish doing the dough. So if you take your flour here, if you take it this way in a bowl and level it up, three cups of flour like that is going to be a pound. I'm saying that because very often recipe tell you less because when you do this, of course if I were to, to sift that flour now, I probably would have a cup and uh, two or three tablespoons. Here we are. Okay. I'm going to have one teaspoon of salt. Mix in there. I'm going to have one and a half teaspoon of baking powder in there. Okay. I mix it a little bit. Okay. And then now I have a cup, a cup and a quarter about. Of, uh, of milk and one egg. Then mixing it with a sturdy spatula. I mean, you could do that in a, you know, in a food processor, but it's really not necessary. Yes. This, of course, is all-purpose flour. Okay, it will get together into a relatively soft mixture. And I'll put that directly on a tray lineup with non-stick, non-stick aluminum foil. That's it. So of course in a regular bread, you put yeast in it and eat the yeast element which make it grow up. And in that case here, it's the baking powder. So it's different. We can bring that back together. If you wet your hand like this, then it's not going to, to stick. Your finger, make a yeah, a roundish loaf like that. Then on top of that, I'm gonna put a bit of flour. And then I'm going to run my knife right through it to make a cross. Yeah. Of course, it sticks a little bit, but it's all right. Make the crust. Okay. I put it into the oven. I like to put an, uh, a metal bowl like that on top of it, like a cover, for about 30 minutes. And then I remove it and cook it another 30 minutes. This is it. My soda bread has been out for like an hour, so it cool off a little bit. And, uh, and that's it, as you can see. Nice, easy to do. Crunchy. I'm sure you're going to enjoy it. Happy cooking.